What's going on guys and girls, it's Ghost Robo. Today we're checking out the Halo 5 Guardians legendary ending. I felt like this was fitting and needed to bring a close and wrap up my Halo 5 series. Super amazing campaign. I thought the normal ending was cool and gave us quite the cliffhanger leading into Halo 6. I wish they would have dove a little bit more into details of what happens next, but that's where the legendary ending comes in. Um, I'm going to show you the full ending plus the little legendary ending extra clip at the end. You can digest that for yourself. We'll come back and talk about about it after you see what happens. Shutting down everything from Earth to the outer colonies. Roland? Found you. Hide and seek's over, Infinity. Lieutenant Jet, emergency slip space now! Galaxy shelters all, but only the created are its masters. We're in the clear, Captain. Can she track us? No reason to think she can. Continue random jump. Steer clear of major settlements. We're just gonna run? Only until we could find a way to fight. Took you long enough. Okay, so you've got all the info that 343 has put out there now. You've seen the legendary ending. You've seen the campaign. <sighs> what is going to happen next? So apparently, uh, that humming is the same humming that 343 Guilty Spark 
uh, has hummed before, and people aren't sure if that is it humming again or if it's Cortana humming, uh, but clearly they found another Halo installation and it's activating. Um, I've seen theories online that it's Cortana activating it. Um, I've seen theories that it's just showing that it's the, the whole universe is cyclical and that the whole thing from Halo 1 is going to happen again, um, and instead of the flood being sort of the ultimate evil that they need to wipe, it's now humanity that it needs to be wiped. Um, I've seen people say that maybe Cortana really isn't Cortana and she She's either been corrupted by 343 or some other power. And I want to know what you guys' thoughts are in the comments down below. So let me know your theory on what the humming and the halo and the whole setup means for Halo 6 and where you think things are going to go from here. I really hope uh, that... I think it would be cool if the game got really intense and really crazy with a conflict between Cortana and Chief. I think that would be super cool. So I hope it's not something like, oh, she's actually a good guy and the, she was corrupted. Like, I really hope she believes firmly in what she's doing and, and it's going to be this epic battle uh, between Chief and Cortana for the rest of the trilogy. I think that would be fantastic. Um, I do think it's super alluring and interesting that they found another Halo. And then that's going to come back into play, and I kind of like the cyclical nature, although that's a very common trope from a lot of sci-fi stories in terms of, like, repeating the past and repeating, you know, the things that their, you know, creators did and that happened before and all of these, like, prophecies and all that jazz. So I'm curious to know what you guys think in the comments below. This will bring a close to our Halo 5 single-player uh, series. I'm still going to be doing multiplayer and rec packs and that fun stuff. It's one of the best multiplayer games I've played in forever. So hopefully I'll see you on that side of things and hopefully I'll see you on some more game walkthroughs as well. Thank you again, guys and girls, for being big supporters and making this one of my best and probably my most viewed series of 2015. I had a super fun time playing with you guys. It's always great to share a super awesome game uh, with other people. So thanks for allowing me to do that and being a part of it. Hope you like the legendary ending. Until next time, guys and girls, drink so much. All thanks again. We will see you all later.